Homeowners in the hamlet of Woodmere, passionate about preserving their century old golf course, dismayed learning that a judge just lifted the moratorium on developing its 120 pristine acres. We're all really stunned because, as you can see, it's beautiful and it's just amazing to look at, and that's one of the reasons why like, we all moved out here. The developer, who refused our request to go on camera, has scaled back his proposal from 350 to 121 homes on half acre and one acre plots abutting Reynolds Channel. And we live in this community because of its beauty and nature, not to have a whole building complex. For months, angry residents have been challenging their elected officials, accusing them of protecting the interests of developers. The Woodmere Club with waning membership was sold, but it is under contractual obligation to remain a golf course until 2021. No digging is imminent. There's no, there's not going to be any shovels or uh, tractor trailers pulling in to start uh, digging up the Woodmere Club anytime soon. The town supervisor is appealing the judge's decision, which may not be resolved for another year. We have to look at the impact on infrastructure, on traffic. There are environmental concerns as well. She says the Army Corps of Engineers is studying the marshy land to determine if housing is even viable. Other options include zoning changes to create a public golf course, an open space park, a coastal residence district with bigger lots limiting the number of homes. Councilman Bruce Blakeman says the judge's ruling will jumpstart action. We're going to come to a conclusion very soon, make a recommendation to the town board. Once various proposals are vetted, community meetings are promised to be held in the five towns and here at Hempstead Town Hall within the next six months. From Woodmere, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. The Five Town Civic Association is demanding to be an integral part of the Hempstead Town Council's plans.